Hey everybody, Tony D and Little Joan here with a hot take. Texas movie theaters reopen with health temperature checks. Uh, this is from Variety and an article by Gene Mattis. Maddows. A handful of movie theaters in San Antonio and Austin, Texas are set to reopen in the coming days, providing an early test case for the beer virus protection measures. Evi Evo Entertainment plans to open two theaters on Monday using airport security style check-in, uh, says the CEO, Mitchell Roberts. Guests will enter a cordoned area near the front of the door where they'll be asked if anyone in their household have had the flu symptoms in the last 14 days. They will also be subjected to an infrared temperature screening with anyone over 100.4 degrees turned away. Is this how you want to go see a movie? I don't know about this. Um, uh, Texas Governor Greg Abbott allowed theaters to reopen beginning Friday at 25% of capacity. So the theater's going to be, I guess, every other seat? No, I guess it would be every third seat filled. So I don't even know how these guys are making money, but I guess they will. Um, sounds to me, sounds to me not a great movie going experience. I mean, I, I and, and listen to the lineup, <laughs> uh, San Antonio, however, Santa Coast entertainment will open three of its nine locations on Saturday, making it one of the first operators in the nation to open its doors. The chain will screen universal's trolls world tour, which has been playing at drive-ins and on video on demand for 1999 as well as several other films like The Hunt that came out just before the shutdown. I don't know. That's that I are people that desperate to see The Hunt and Trolls World Tour on the big screen? I don't even know why you would want to see Trolls World Tour unless you got kids and you're going to bring your kids out in this. I kind of think that's a non-starter. I I I, I kind of think uh I think the whole situation you might as well just open it up. I mean, really says here we're opening more for psychological value than net income <laughs> says ceo tim hart Andrit. that's what theaters are for an escape we're going to provide that escape i don't know how much how much of an escape you really provide if i got to go through that entire ordeal the chinese were using the thermometer guns and they didn't even work half the time i don't know if that's really a good screening process but i guess it's better than nothing I mean, as long as everybody's masked up and they, they wash their hands and they don't touch their face, who cares? But quite frankly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go. I just wouldn't go. I, I you know, I don't want to, I, first off, the, the movie theater experience has been pretty awful already. <laughs> Prior to the virus, it was, it was getting pretty awful. You know, it was hard. The snacks are too expensive. The, the, the going through the door it's too much money. I'd rather watch the damn movie at home. The only thing I'm going to watch in a movie theater, and I think a lot of people agree, are big movies. Like movies that you want to see on a big screen. Like Avengers Endgame. Like that I wanted to go see in a movie theater. Because that's a movie you see on the big screen. Anything else, I can watch on... I got a TV here. It's pretty big. It's big enough. And... You know, even on my computer screen, I can watch movies and it's fine. I, I you know, I think it, this is really, we're really about to see the end of movie theaters. They're going to have to rethink their business model and provide a better experience. And that's half the reason you go, right? To get an experience. You get the food, um, you, you hang out with your friends or your family, and you all go. Now you're going to be masked up. Now you're going to be searched like you're going to the freaking airport. Now you're going to have to sit far apart. That's going to suck. <laughs> I can't make comments. I can't make snarky comments in the middle of the movie with everybody sitting far away from me. That that's going to suck. I, I want to I want to sneak in food from the Chinese food place. I want to do whatever the hell I want in the theater. I don't want to be subjected to searches and screenings. I mean, this sounds... Now, not to knock these guys, they're trying. 
I, I totally understand. Oh, it says here, both Evo and Santa Cosa are charging discounted prices. $5 a ticket, $3 a children at uh, EVO. Okay, so that's good. That's good. I could see that. All right, so you're making it cheaper. So maybe. But, you know, I, I don't know. I, what do you think about the movie experience? Do you think this is going to help? Do you think people are going to come out for this? Is this how people watch movies now? It's not how I watch movies anymore. I don't know, man. This this sounds like... This doesn't sound like a great plan. It doesn't sound like a great plan. Maybe in parts of the country where people are still... I gotta go to the movies, but... I, I kind of think... We need to get back to where it was. And I understand... You know, these people got to make money and they're trying the best they can. I'm not sure this is the experience people are going to want. 